everybody and welcome back to In the Sparrow's Nest. We're so happy that you're getting a chance to join us today. I wanted to take an opportunity and change out Laurel Rose. Laurel Rose has been wearing this really pretty sleeveless, um, kind of like a linen um, jumper. It's an over, it's a one piece, kind of like an overall. Um, let's call it a coverall. <laughs> it's really, really pretty. It has an, an open front with these buttons down the, um, and white buttons down the front. And I really love this design because it's very easy to put on a baby that has beautifully rooted hair um, like Laurel does. But I'm going to change her into another overall or a coverall that is also sleeveless, but this time it's legless too. So it's just a, it's, I guess it's kind of like a onesie. You would call it a onesie. Um, it has uh, no sleeves, but little like kind of like little flyaway sleeves. I guess they're like little ruffle sleeves. And it's a really pretty brown and white checkered um, pattern. And it has these little embroidered pink flowers, uh, two at the top on the chest, and then a little bit of a grouping down here on the right side of the leg. And um, it's got an open back. And so it's going to be really easy to slip over Laurel's head. And I'm going to give her some just white socks and these really pretty uh, velvet. Um, they're kind of like... I guess they'd be in between a winter shoe and a summer shoe, but it matched so perfectly, I just couldn't resist. There are these brown corduroy with little pink trim and the pink flowers, and I thought it looked beautiful. And then we're going to top it off with a really pretty pink bow that we're going to put in her hair. So I'm going to go ahead and remove her overall, and I'll be right back. All right, darling. Now our Laurel Rose is the Tobias Sculpt by Laura Lee Eagles. And she was reborn by Suzanne of Baby Bunting Nursery. Her box opening was a lot of fun. Just beautiful. And of course, the video in which we had to go find Laurel was even more fun. And I went back and I checked to see how long ago Laurel came into our nursery. And I was shocked. I was like, I cannot believe it's been four years. Four years. Where does the time even go? And then I started thinking, well, four years, I know that I had to, I had deleted all of my video content from four years ago, over four years ago, when YouTube went through all of that fuss and magus over um, which videos were considered made for adults and which were made for children. So foolishly, instead of just privatizing the videos, I just deleted all of them. And I still have the videos, but I don't know if her video is still on YouTube. So what I end up, what I might end up having to do is reload those videos. And um, I probably will do that. So if anyone was interested in seeing how Laurel came into our nursery, that video would be available. I need a little diaper. We do we use cloth diapers here, and that was an old fashioned cloth diaper. This is really cute. I want to make sure I get those little ruffles out so we can see those legs. I really love this sculpt because um, she has uh, full limbs, so it makes it a lot of fun to um, dress them in outfits that it has their legs and arms showing. So I really love this sculpt. And of course, Suzanne did an amazing job reborning her. I just love her so much. Well, we love her. Braddy loves her very much too. Gosh, that was a fun video. <laughs> oh, it was like a, like a, a mystery where we had to uh, solve puzzles to find her. This is really cute and it fits her really well. This is a three to six month size. And um, let me put those little socks on. You know, I'm so excited to go to the doll show in June. Now, wait a minute. I know there's supposed to be two socks here and there's only one. Hold on a second. Okay, second sock has been found. And they're cute because they're white and they have a little satin trim around the cuff with little pink hearts. I thought it was so cute. So as I was saying, um, 
they uh, the show that's in at the end of June. Just really excited to go and see friends who are going to be there. I really wish everybody could go and be there um, because there's nothing like I, I keep saying that there's nothing like being in a room full of people who love the hobby as much as you do. <laughs> so it's going to be great. My mom is going to be there. My elder sister is going to be there. Luciana is going to be there. And I have some more news. My nephew, Armando, he's going to be there too. Because he is coming to come and visit and stay with me for a little bit. He comes every summer and we always have so much fun. And my one of my older nephews is going to bring him on an airplane. So we don't have to drive in the car to go get him. All right, miss, let us, let us brush your hair real quick. And you know what? I'm going to borrow your brother Tony's comb because it's just or his little brush. It's right here. Just dress, brush this a little bit. So, so soft. Get this on, so. And I'm, you know what? <laughs> And you know me, I'm always looking at baby dolls and I'm like, nope, can't buy any more baby dolls. And then I'm like, well, you know what? I am going to a show and I'll be honest, I, I'll find it hard to believe if I don't come home with at least one baby doll. So I've already been moving some babies around the nursery here so that we can make just a little bit more room. Okay, so I'm going to sit her up so you can see her fully dressed. Oh, she looks so cute in this. I think the shoes look good. They look really cute. Oh, I hear Bonnie snoring. <laughs> there she is. And and uh, to match her, she's holding uh, little bear Prosha. Prosha is actually one of the very first bears that I bought from bearpile.com. There's another site that I don't go visit very often anymore. My room is so full of beautiful plushes, though, and I recommend going if you uh, if you're looking for a handmade teddy bear or uh, I've actually have uh, all types of plushies, cats and bugs and well, you just name it. Um, I probably have a stuffed animal version of it, but I love Bear Pile because they're all handmade. They're all handmade by artists. So thank you all again, and as always, we wish you much love and peace. Peace always be with you. Bye.